So our last episode for Thailand is about Chiang Rai. And uh, Chiang Rai is northern is a northern city uh, in Thailand. It's around 100 kilometers from Chiang Mai. And uh, it's a small city. Um, I thought nothing very spectacular uh, to see there, uh, but we have still managed to uh, have two or three highlights. Yeah, I mean, actually, you have to go through Chiang Rai if you want to go to Laos. That's the most popular route. So that's what we did. And um, one highlight was certainly the clock tower in the center, a lot of gold. Uh, well, in the end, it's not that spectacular, but still a nice um, spot to see John Ryan. to the White Temple with a thousand other tourists. Um, it's basically a Buddhist temple, but nothing uh, that we have seen before. Um, it's an art, um, Thai artist who imagined this, and um, basically it's made out of millions of um, small mirror pieces, as well as uh, white ceramic, I guess. Um, so I was, I, I didn't feel at ease, I thought it was quite um, uh, unnatural and um, I didn't like his style, but um, I mean, in contrary to all the other temples, the Y temple has a more modern um, Approach, I would say, especially the paintings inside the temple, which we were not allowed to film, are much more modern. Um, yeah, but I think it was worth it to see. The whole site is very touristy for sure, but um, in the end, I enjoyed uh, driving there with the motorbike and see uh, the summit. As we already had a motorbike, we continued uh, driving around Chiang Rai and uh, we went through some rice fields as in many parts of Southeast Asia. Um, we got lost, uh, we arrived to a big amusement park called Singa Park, so Singa is a big uh, beer brand. After that we went actually to the place that we were searching for. So that place is called Mai Fa Luang and it's uh, a lot of information about teak 
um, the wood. And there was a uh, very nice museum um, showing all the different ways in which you can use tea and uh, how it has been used also in the past and uh, showing beautiful uh, artwork and um, especially um, utensils and um, everyday objects. We checked a couple of options and actually there are not a lot. Actually there is a very old bus going to Laos and it will stop at the French Bridge which is exactly the border between Thailand and Laos and that's exactly what we are gonna talk about in the next YouTube video. See you then! Thank you.